It is time for us to leave. Just checking out the house one more time. Jason's pulling the car out. I'll go shut the garage door. And we're headed home. up in the car it is 6 37 we have we're gonna make one minor stop for a charge in about 25 30 minutes just to get us for sure to our Twin Falls charge it is well it says it's nine degrees but I think it's just adjusting from being in the garage yeah. my dad said it was one, one degrees degree. outside <laughs> so it's so cold um, hopefully it's warmer along the way. Storms are coming in kind of behind us as we're traveling. And so, um, I'm part of the reason why we're leaving today, but also with storms comes warmer weather. So we're kind of hoping as we go along that we'll have warmer weather and the battery will last longer. So we shall, shall see if we can do this better in, than 16 hours, <laughs> like we did. Was it really 16? Yeah, it was. Sorry. Yeah. Oh, you can just see her back there. So I was, did drive a lot slower because of weather, and well, then also well, also because you couldn't, you in order to like maintain. Well, if you have one stretch, that one stretch, it told us not to go yeah. over 84 in order to make it to our next destination. So we shall see. Falls again and we are not going to charge first <laughs> we are gonna go straight to Neater's for breakfast and have that yummy French toast if you remember from our summer vacations driving through and the croissant tells she likes the chocolate croissant croissant I was very tired so there weren't very many camera clips <laughs> During that last little stretch, I kind of pat yeah, we all slept except for good old dad. I like that he likes to drive. Um, so we're gonna go and get breakfast really quick, and and then we'll go and charge. Um, oh, there's a Target, Ashley. Maybe we could go. Do you want me to drop you off there and I come pick you up? We could do I that, charge? Ash. Do you want to do that, or do you want a Walmart? A Walmart? Just Might, because just we, don't we don't have, have a Walmart. One. Might be something different. So we thought about like trying to utilize our time at the charge um, instead of have, having to just sit in the car. I'll sit and watch a movie, all you girls. This time, I think we'll stop and we'll go into Walmart and we'll get some car snacks. And then Kay Ashley's still looking for a Wait, present for Kaylee. Car what car snacks do you want? Or I can text you while we're there. But um, it, anyway, so. She's actually on a call with her friends. Um, they all woke up. <laughs> so we're just going to try and utilize the stops. He'll drop us off at the store, go and sit in charge, and then we'll just he'll come and get us when he's done charging. So Chelsea and I are going to watch Avatar. We still have another. Oh, you're going to stay with yeah, her? We'll still have with him? We'll go with Avatar. All right. So that's, I'm going to check in with Kaylee and Abby, but they're probably not awake yet. And uh, just so that um, Michelle knows, I just read your comment on today's video that went out about your package coming in the mail. Um, it's going to be here tomorrow and we're very excited to get it. And uh, we will open it in a video. Um, I wasn't planning on filming tomorrow, but what I'm gonna do is film opening that package. Um, and then maybe either I'll insert it into this video or in whatever day I film next because I want I already know it's kind of in the package and it's gonna be really fun to open it and show you guys I'm very excited and you guys are so supportive Michelle you're very supportive of our family and we appreciate it 
I also have my Christmas cards waiting for me at home to address very quickly tomorrow and get them out into the mail to you guys. I have a whole stack of addresses to mail them to you guys so if you want one um, and you haven't sent me your address already or you haven't sent me a card, um, go ahead over to, in, to Instagram and DM me and give me your address and I will send one to you. Um, uh, I also have some in the mail from some of you. My Abby has been getting our mail and she's like, Mom, we got more Christmas cards and the kids are very excited to get them. It's very Neaters. fun. Neaters. And Walmart is perfect. Oh gosh. Perfect. A perfect union. Uh, yeah, breakfast oh, and Walmart. If only there was a charging station right here. That would have been like glory Because I'm going to have to go and come back. Yeah, that's fine. I thought there was Walmart closer. There's a gift on Santa's sleigh. Hey, guess what I just scheduled? What? Your first consult for your surgery. For when? Uh, February, it's like the 7th, I think. That's as soon as they could get it. But this is your okay. first consult appointment. It gets the ball rolling for surgery. I finally got a hold of someone and they were able, they were making it seem like it was just a, con a follow up from your last oral surgery and I was like no 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 I don't want to waste an appointment with that we need to start with the consults with surgery and CT scans and like so she finally was able to clarify that that is what this appointment is we're starting that so that's exciting yeah how are you guys doing good I yeah. just woke up okay can you just make sure you have all your chores done your the dishes done yeah. Even do a load of laundry because we're gonna have a lot of laundry when we get home. Okay. Okay. We're on the road. We're in Twin. Um, we're waiting for the car to charge up. Abby, Ashley, and I are at Walmart. Okay. Okay. We'll be home later tonight. Okay. You good? Yeah. Okay. It snowed a bit here yesterday and like last night. But yeah. There's not too much. Not too much. It's supposed to snow again tomorrow and th Wednesday. Yeah. So. Alrighty, we'll be, we'll be on the road and we'll see you soon. Okay, bye. Okay. Alright, bye. Alright, waiting for Ashley to go to the bathroom. But uh, we've just been doing some shopping. Ashley got all of her stuff for Kaylee. And I got a few things for the kids and for home. Uh, I also got my wrapping paper. Sorry for the foot flushes. I'm trying to be discreet and hide from the customers. I got wrapping paper for next year. Because this rule. It's so thick and it's only five dollars. So, and actually found this one. It has dog, it's dog prints. <laughs> okay, we are officially on the road again. Um, here is, the, what is this again? The Snake River? Uh, I don't think you can see it down there. Not sure. Um, but we are headed back on the road. It took a lot longer than expected, but I think each charge is going to take longer because it seems like it's colder. I don't, yeah. You know, the battery's not as prepped even though we preconditioned. It was constantly preconditioning. Uh, Which uses battery. It's just battery. colder. Plus I think the uh, charging stations. Cows. You know, I don't know. Cows? Cows. Chelsea, like you haven't seen a cow. That was Ashley. Ashley. Oh, it was Ashley? You can't even tell the difference. I just heard noise coming from behind me. So you assumed it was me? Anyway. So we're headed back out and I just stopped really quick and got my cold beverage. And I like calling it a cold beverage, it sounds better. We're on the road. Is that an eye roll from you? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Let's go. We find a way. Made it to our next charging station. I am watching YouTube. And Jason and the girls, where did they go to? A and W. <laughs> it's interesting because we're stopping at the same stops and we're like, oh yes, that's what we got to eat last time. So he is letting them experience A and W. Um, we had the fries when we 
came out to Utah, um, but they hadn't tried anything else. So Chelsea's gonna try a burger and of course the root beer. If you guys didn't know, um, Jason and I's first date was at an A&W. Like one of the original in our town um, and it was like iconic and it was, anyway, so A&W is kind of our thing even though there's no A&W in Washington, or at least nothing close. And so he wants the kids to experience the A&W. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna get an a and I might eat their leftovers. The problem is it's like three hours away until the next charging station. So if I don't choose to eat now, I have too long to wait to get something to eat. But I'm gonna see what they say. They're just in there either getting their food or eating in there um, while the, the car charges. And um, I'm, I'm enjoying watching my show because they're gonna come out and watch Avatar as soon as um, they come back to the car. So I'm watching what I wanna watch. Here they come. Looks like it took a long time to get the food. They haven't even eaten it. Ashley's moved from shorts to pants, but still sh short sleeves. Guess what? What? They don't have fries. How do they not have fries? I know, they're bringing them in from Boise, but they don't know when they'll be here. here. So then like, but you can have anything on the KFC side. Like, and I'm like, what are those? Biscuits, yeah, gravy, no. <laughs> mashed potatoes, I'm like, can yeah, I, I want it. Oh dear. So we got mac and cheese. Oh, you want that, right? No. Did you order that or Chelsea ordered that? I don't know. Well, Dad did, but I asked. All right, what else did you get? And then some burgers. Oh, uh, oh, oh, yeah, you guys got... Uh, no candy, put it down. <laughs> She's already like... Uh, put it down in my mouth. These little uh, corn dog <laughs> things. <laughs> oh, I don't want... Yeah, Chelsea wants those. Corn dogs. Oh, we did get an extra little cheeseburger. Grow your own popcorn. <laughs> Can you not eat any more candy, please? <laughs> Ashley, put the candy down, please. <laughs> she's only had two pieces, and she's already like going nuts. <laughs> Shh. Yeah, it's just, no, it's, it's because she's been drinking the, drinking the root beer. This girl is like. <laughs> I'm sorry, but you gotta. Yeah. Get, wait, they both look the same. <laughs> started happening and we're so glad we got through the blues the what is it called blew it pass uh, is that what it's technically called i don't know dead, man pass? dead man's pass yes I think so. um we still have to get through baker and legrand in this but uh we're glad we got through the steep cliffs and hills so no now we need to get through all we have the only pass we have left is so far we already got through baker and legrand oh we did yeah now we're back there Oh, that's right. It was so smooth, you didn't even realize. No, it was. It was smooth. I can barely see you. All right, let's get through this. We're headed to, where are we headed to? Yakima next? Yakima is next. And Yakima is two hours away from home. So we've got four hours left. Okay, a little bit of a, an update and a change of plans. We are not going home tonight. Um, we're about two hours away from home. We are just leaving, um, it's called Yakima. Oh, look, there's some snow now. Literally just started snowing. Um, we've been watching the um, transportation webcams on the pass ahead of us. It's called Snoqualmie Pass. And it is down to one lane of traffic, really heavy, thick snow in that one lane. And chains required or all-wheel drive, which we have all-wheel drive, and no trucks are allowed to go through. And that one tells me it's, it's bad. They don't let trucks through um, and it's only an hour and an hour ish to get through that pass on a normal day but on the traffic like map it has a red line of traffic 100% of the way home once we hit the pass and then there's a few portions of it where it's red and completely stopped in traffic we would be in it for about three four hours if we actually decided to go through, which would put us at two in the morning, potentially. And it's just not worth all that risk and worry and traffic and, you know, whatever. So we just looked, looked, 
got us a bed to, for the night. And uh, we're just going to hole up and try and be safe and get a good night's sleep. And uh, we'll get on the road tomorrow morning when it's light and a little bit safer to go. Um, and so keep following our journey and make sure we get home. Okay, I cut Jason off. Oh, nothing. Just saying that we've learned a lot on this uh, trip on how to travel in an electric vehicle. Definitely a lot. Yeah, we have. Um, it actually helped a ton when it did start to snow and we were slowed down. Our battery, just the percentage, it went right back up. And so we learned, you know, if we need to like save and conserve on battery and like get a little bit further, especially with like weather, you slow down, and then you'll you'll be able to get a little bit further and, and reduce that risk. So. Praying we get home. I, I, <laughs> we will. We're we will. Going through the pass would be sketchy. Yeah. It would feel it'd be white knuckle. And there's no point. There's no point. It. Uh, there's no point doing that. So it'll just be safe. We got the kids at home and here. Yeah, I've checked in with the kids at home. And Kaylee's going to get them some dinner, and and they're just going to get home and be home safe. So all is good and well. made it safely to the quality inn. <laughs> it's fantastic. And it is dumping. And we've already slid around on the roads. The ground is covered in snow. It is slick. Our car did slip and slide as we got off the high highway. Uh, meanwhile, Chelsea thinks that's why is to do Crocs and snow. Ashley also did them. Don't Crocs and snow? How's that working out for you, Chelsea? <laughs> okay, here's our lovely quality inn for the night. We will be with you in the morning after we get a good night's sleep and we will see if the pass is open. Our cousins, Jason's brother and his wife, just said if the pass is closed and we can't make it home tomorrow, their kids are skipping school. Yes, they have one more day of school before Christmas break and they're gonna skip school and come play with us. <laughs> or we will go play with them because we'll be kicked out of our hotel at 11 o'clock in the morning, so. <laughs> We will sign off with you tonight, pick up in the morning, because I only want this to be one video. So, <laughs> I want a day off from filming a video, which is technically tomorrow. So we're just gonna include this all in today. Okay, day two, winter wonderland out there. <laughs> wipers <laughs> they are they get clogged up with ice and we thought it was just the Tesla but everyone is having to stop and everyone is having to wipe their wipers off um, it's just so bad out here and I just um, looked at the weather report for um, WADOT Washington DOT and the pass is officially closed but we're in the middle of it um, it is closed eastbound coming from where we live um, and then they closed it from where we just came from. And so we're 
literally stuck in it and it's just they're just trying to push all the rest of us traffic out of the can out of the pass um, so we're all just going slow we're all just following each other trying to make divots in the snow we don't know where the snow plows are they're not existent I saw two going that way we haven't seen ago. any of them coming our direction it at all look like this has been plowed in an hour in more than that so we're just you know white knuckling it or he is and I'm not I'm not getting on my phone I'm not I'm just I'm literally like face out the window and I'm working the uh, defrost and the temperature in the car and helping to do the wipers when I can um, it's you know but this is what I was worried about I knew the or I had a feeling the car would do it okay itself but I was worried that if this pass closed down and there's I mean I don't the forecast doesn't show the snow stopping for a long time today tomorrow um, on this end of it and I don't know when the pass is gonna open up and I don't want to get stuck on the other end of it being away from Kaylee and Abby if it, we were all together we would make the best of it and we would have a good holiday break get a hotel whatever buy some swimsuit a Walmart I don't know but like uh, uh, swimsuit meaning hotel pool that kind of thing but I need to be with my other kids for the holiday break so we're just we're glad that we got in and we're just working our way back out of the pass and he's a great driver he grew up in Alaska he knows how to do this it's just this dang windshield it's just I, you can't even tell but it we've got all the antifreeze from the um, luckily in Logan there I thought it had frozen up, but instead we just ran out, and I grabbed a winter de-icer yeah. windshield wiper, and it's coming in pretty handy. We wouldn't have been able to go. No, it would have been. We wouldn't have been able wouldn't, to go. Wouldn't so. have been able to do it. So, like true blessing. So fast. But I'm gonna turn the camera off. I really do need to like help him focus on the road. Find sometimes my window has a better view out into the snow like down onto the ground Ooh, walmart's got to get there oh walmart's gonna get their deliveries in <laughs> they just passed better us better not block the highway with an accident by sliding i out. know piss me off um Need one more reason not to shop at walmart but i'm gonna turn the camera off stop he's still flipping even in stressful situations but i'm gonna turn the camera off i sometimes have better view of the road so i tell him okay go over here to the right go over here to the left so i can't even hold the camera Back in a minute. Speaking of clouds, he's coming and we're gonna get him right behind it. Here he comes. He's right there. Oh my gosh. Glorious. Put your thing down. Oh, he is. Okay. And there's the other plow. He's going the other way. And we're just gonna. Uh, where's this guy going? Oh, let's see. That girl has had to go bathroom for two hours. And we finally found a gas station. <laughs> and it's safe enough to pull over and stop. There's less um, snow on the roads here. So that's Twin Peaks. So we're gonna hurry and go to the bathroom. All right, a few more crappy snacks and a beverage. And let's see if that'll make us a, survive the rest of this. I don't know. Why is there what? Some truck pulled into the Oh, I don't know. Just be another douche. Oh dear. We can go no. towards well, Seattle. Yeah, but that's up there. Oh, it's up there. for a long time but we made it home safe 
We are going to um, go home and be with Kate and Abby. I'm sure they're going to tell us that we need food and they're going to want us to go right back out. I'm not going to want to. <laughs> I'll probably do it tomorrow. So we're going to sign off with you and we'll be back another day. Um, thanks for going on this little white knuckle adventure with us. Um, yep, we made it home. Take care, you guys. Happy holidays. Decorating the tree.